All right, we're here in Huntington, New York, at the screening of The Chemist, and we're here with the star, Olivier Gruner. Olivier, how are you, brother? Good, awesome. Uh, you, ha, ha, you made, you've been in a lot of movies. Yeah. How did it feel working with Art Camacho? Well, you know, this is not the first time I, uh, I work with Art, so this is my second film. And uh, the thing about a director and an actor, it doesn't matter if it's the star of the film or just an actor, it's a relationship between the both, and it's really important that we get along. And we have a lot of laugh also as well, but the job has to be done. And the good thing with art is like we got along. It's like we have chemistry. You do or you don't. Right. So we have it. And I think, uh, you know, we did a pretty good job on this one. I think I'm very pleased with what I've seen. You know, that, that, that's, uh, the camera work was excellent. Uh, uh, the acting for me, uh, for what I've seen, is great, you know. And uh, I can't wait to see the finished product. You know. And the best thing about it, and I'm not gonna even, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna spoil it, but you, you get to do something, Marty Cove. I love Marty Cove. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got you got more Coves in here. Uh, one of the producers is Tom Renner, and you have a lot of great actors in here. Uh, was it uh, Kristen, uh, Christina Hess, right? Uh huh. Yeah. And then um, who, who was the, who was the other girl? Did she? Don't ask me. I, I, I <laughs> don't. don't oh, I, she scared me. That's why I forgot her name. I call it Pretty Lady. <laughs> the, the, the Pretty Lady. The Pretty Lady. You know, but it, it was oh, a, Stephanie. It, yeah, yeah, Stephanie was. Uh, uh, my co-star, can we call it? Yeah, co-star, yeah. Your love interest, uh, maybe. <laughs> yeah, love interest, you know. She, uh, she's full of energy, and it, uh, she has such a great energy. She's a wonderful person, so that was great to work with her. Um, <clears throat> you know, the, 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 the thing that we should, do about, we should say about this film is, like, nowadays, in the 90s, it was, it was easier to make films. Even now, with the technology... It's not as easy because everybody claimed that they can't do things, but actually we find out later on that they cannot do things, you know? Uh, it's not because you have a computer and... Uh, uh, the CGI. The CGI and even, you know, like, you know how to use a little bit the, your computer that you can make movies. There's more to it, you know? And I think uh, what's amazing is uh, uh, knowing that somebody started a film actually talks about making a film, number one. Number two is having a screenplay and then put it on screen and see it on screen finished. And that's a big, big, big uh, uh, accomplishment. And I know a lot of people, you know, they look at films and say, oh, it was okay. Uh, but you know, the work behind that film, doesn't matter who it is, doesn't matter what kind of film it is, it's a lot of work. And uh, a, a film that is 90 minutes, I think, any producers, any director, uh, I shake their hands because it's so hard to finish a film. And nine, 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 90 minutes is maybe like, I don't know, like 300 hours of filming? Yeah, it's a lot of hours. Not only that, the film is, the film is not a big deal. It's after the post-production, you know? So that's a lot of work. So sometimes it takes a year, you know? It's funny because in the 90s, we used to say it takes nine months, like a baby, you know, to make a movie. And now... Uh, we were thinking things would go so fast, but actually it doesn't go so fast. It's the same. We need approximately six to seven months to finish a complete movie from start to, to end. And this was a labor of love for, all, for everyone involved. Yeah. Well, uh, the good thing is we had the screening here in New York, which is great because um, uh, it's not like L.A. L.A., everybody would criticize every little things, you know, here. It's like friends get together and they watch a movie and we didn't have a sound. I mean, the sound, we didn't have any sound. So can you imagine watching 90 minutes with half of the film without sound and without music? That's pretty, and nobody walked out. So that's a really, really cool, uh, a great uh, sign that the film is going to be great. And what, what it did is showed the work behind the film. Absolutely, because, you know, when you have uh, the sound, the, the foley, all that kind of stuff, you look at it and it's a done product, that's all you're going to get. Now we saw, actually, I can call it kind of a edited dailies. It's just whatever we shot, we put it on a timeline, and that's all we have. No sound effects, no music, nothing. And people stayed in the theater, and even me, I looked at it, because this is my first time I see it from start to finish, and uh, I stayed in the theater. If it was boring, I would walk out, trust me. But it was cool. I mean, there is a lot of, uh, the way it was filmed was really well filmed, and uh, great job on Art Camacho's direction, and uh, the actors were excellent, you know, and I think uh, 
uh, I think we got something uh, really good actually at the end. Well, I think you have a great product and the thing is with screenings it gives you the opportunity to actually tweak things as you go along before you have that final product going out for distribution. And especially you know we have people laughing, people applauding, you know this is great. It's a great thing when you see people getting excited and, and laugh. We got a couple laugh that which is great because it's harder to make people laugh than cry, you know. And, that, that, that's what we're, that, and that's what we're talking about here. So I want you to go and uh, see, we're just going to be interrupted here, so I'm going to ask him to, like, move away. And I, I, need to make I need to make sure that you guys check out The Chemist, go to Facebook, go online, look at the trailers and look at everything because at the end of the day, when you see this film, trust me, trust me, you're going to enjoy it. Yeah, great. Olivier, thank, thank you so you. much, brother. Thank you very much.